Hi guys, so today is Monday and it is the first official day of my cut. Um, I just thought I would let you guys know how I'm going with that. Just because a couple of you have been asking like where I'm at with training, where I am with nutrition and all of that stuff. So today is the first day of my cut. Um, I've been, I guess, in like a bulking phase for the last month. That was my cat. Um, for like the last month or so. So that's been really good. I've really enjoyed being able to eat like so much food. But um, as much as I'm like disappointed that I can't eat that much food anymore, I'm also really excited to see um, kind of what's like been going on under all of that. Because obviously when you're bulking, like you are least focused about actually losing weight. So I've really been trying to use all that extra energy from all the extra food to build as much muscle, build as much muscle as possible, um, and really just try build up my strength as well. So that's where I'm at. I'm still doing my six week program. This is week five, so I've got two weeks left of that. Um, so the training is going really well. Um, I hit my deadlift goal the other day, so I was really really happy about that. Um, yeah, all going really, really well. I'm not cutting for anything in particular. I'm not competing anytime soon. It's literally just to see like how my body is going to react to because I've never actually done like a proper bulk and then a cut straight after that. So it's really kind of just to see like how my body responds to that and what is going on up in here. I'm a bit nervous about my energy levels. I know they're going to be like non-existent, but um. That's why we have pre-workout, am I right? So today, um, you guys seem to really enjoy my last recipe video. So today I have another one for you guys. No, it's not Chris this time. Um, it is a Cellicore mug cake. For those of you who have never tried Cellicore protein before, I highly, highly, highly recommend going and buying some off the Protein King website. Hands down, like top three favorite proteins. They've got flavors like s'mores, um, cookies and cream, chop chip cookie dough. They've got red velvet cake batter. Like they have every flavor that you could think of and it's actually really good. They've got peanut butter marshmallow as well. So if you know me, you know I love peanut butter. Um, and they have like little chunks of stuff in. So the chop chip cookie dough one has like chunks of cookies in. The peanut butter marshmallow one has chunks of marshmallow and like it is... Incredible. So today I'm going to be making a choc chip cookie dough mug cake using Cellicor's um, choc chip cookie dough protein. So I'm just going to let you guys know exactly what you need and then I will kind of like speed up the video so it's not just me like measuring stuff. Um, so you need two tablespoons of coconut flour, one tablespoon of a protein of your choice. I do recommend the choc chip cookie dough just because... Like I said, it's got actual bits of cookies in it, so it just gives like a little bit of texture. Um, then you need two egg whites. I just use the pure egg, simply egg whites. One tablespoon of plain Greek yogurt. Um, two tablespoons of unsweetened almond milk. I use the Blue Diamond Almond Breeze. Um, half a teaspoon of baking powder and one stevia packet, so not like that much. A stevia packet is literally like that big and I think you can just buy them um, in the packets from the supermarket. So those are the ingredients. I'm just going to whisk everything up real quick and I will let you guys know what it comes up looking like. First things first, I'm the village. Drop this and let the whole world feel it. Uh, and I'm still in the murder business. I can hold you down like I'm giving lessons to fix back. You should want a bad bitch like this. Drop it long, pick it up just like this. Cup of eggs, cup of ghosts, cup of Chris, high heels, set the war, they have a ticket on my wrist, ayy Taking out a lick, straight, never chase that Rooftop like we're bringing 88 back Bring the hooks in, where the bass at? Champagne spinning, yeah, you should taste that I'm so fancy, yeah, you already know I'm in the Um, so I've mixed it all together I don't know if you guys can kind of see the consistency It does thicken up a little bit So I'm just gonna microwave that for a minute and a half to two minutes just watch that it doesn't like overflow because obviously you don't want that. Oh. Baby, I do this. I thought that you knew this. Guess there's no haters and honest the truth is. My flow restarted. Each beat did the body. So it's just come out the microwave. It rose really nicely. And that is the finished product. If you guys want to make um, like 
a sauce type thing to go over it, you can do that. Um, I know some people can just mix up um, some protein powder, mix up quite a lot of protein powder um, with a little bit of water and then it just comes out it's like it's quite thick con consistency. Pour that over, pour some syrup, some peanut butter, pretty much whatever you guys want. Um, but yeah, that is the finished product and it tastes so good. I'll show you guys what it looks like on the inside. It's like an actual little cake. That's what it looks like on the inside. It's perfect little cake. And I'm now going to go stuff this in my face. But thanks guys for watching. I'll keep you updated on my Instagram and my training, my nutrition, how my cut's going, and all of that sort of thing. But um, thank you for watching, and until next week, bye.